Now, the school year is set to start soon, and that means school zone traffic cameras will be turned back on, and they won't be the only ones to look out for this year. The city is planning on reactivating some red light cameras. Rachel Hanley explains why. It's almost time to hit the brakes. Starting August 1st, school zone cameras are back on for two hours in the morning and two in the afternoon. It slows me down. It does slow me down. Going above 20 miles an hour will result in some unpleasant mail. And for the first time in a while, so will speeding and running red lights outside of school zones. This camera near Carrollton and Banks was damaged during Hurricane Ida. So were nine others. They're all fixed now, and on August 1st, the city will turn them on with all of the rest of them. Of the 10 cameras that will be reactivated, six are on South Carrollton. All of them are at or near red lights, not in school zones, but at least one is also close to a school. New Orleans traffic cameras have been controversial since they were first turned on 15 years ago. It's obviously a difficult situation to deal with. Uh, no one likes more cameras. I feel like a policeman should have to talk to you if you're getting a ticket so that you can defend yourself. Then in 2020, an inspector general report accused the city of not overseeing the camera program closely enough. Among other issues, it found drivers were being ticketed for disobeying school zones when school wasn't in session. A survey showed the majority of residents were against the cameras. There's so many cameras here, you know, in this one particular couple blocks. And yet there's many other areas that are concerning to me. And even now, there are plenty of people with mixed feelings. People that will tailgate us, it becomes often more dangerous to go the speed limit because people are um, either tailgating us or trying to bypass us. The city calls the cameras a critical component of its effort to make streets safer. It even claims it gets daily requests to install new cameras from residents and neighborhoods. Rachel Handley, Eyewitness News. Rachel, thank you. To dispute a camera ticket, you have to mail in a request to set up a hearing. Those hearings happen in person. Again, the cameras will be turned on next Tuesday. That's August 1st. The school zones are active from 7 to 9 in the morning and then 2.45 to 4.45 in the afternoons.